Irate residents backed by their legislators on Wednesday last week blocked five oil trucks destined for Mombasa at Kalemorok along Lokichar Kapenguria Highway, demanding among others improved security, jobs and share of the oil revenue. But on Thursday, after lengthy deliberations by stakeholders, the Rift Valley Regional Commissioner Mongo Chimwag announced that the concerns raised by the community will be addressed with immediate effect to ensure the Tulu oil operations resumes. Uh, the concerns with respect to security, uh, we have we have prescri prescribed what is required to be done, uh, a review of the, the, the deployment within the county. Uh, they've given the leaders have given specific areas that they would wish us to to strengthen. Combined teams of security personnel will now be deployed in the troubled areas to combat cases of banditry and cattle rustling. Petroleum Cabinet Secretary John Munez assured that concerns raised by locals on oil will be taken into consideration. Members of parliament drawn from the region urged the government to fulfill its promises instead of just making empty rhetorics. <laughs> Na hiyo muda mmetupea sisi tutaenda kama viongozi kuongea na watu wetu kuwa convince kuwa hivi ndio vile tumekubaliana na tunaamini watatusikiza serikali na hii hakikishe imefanya ile yote imesema kama wamesema wataeta askari kwa daraja iwekwe wakati sisi tunapambana Jumatano hiyo kuhakikisha tumeconvince watu Hawa nae wapambane kwa agisha kwamba wameka security, wameka KPR kwa hii muda, ili tuweze kwa aminiana. The trucks transporting the oil will now resume operations from Wednesday next week. Tulo is said to have been incurring 25 million shillings in losses every day as the trucks remain blocked by the locals.